Hello everybody, my name is Katamor. Welcome back for another video of Total War Rome 2. Let's continue this series, boys. We did very good for the last two videos. We started to expand up here. Uh, we're doing uh, so good that um, our empire is actually at war with uh, quite a lot of enemies right now. Well, we are at war with the Armenians, the Cardi, both of them together. So we got to deal with this bullshit over here. We got to worry about the Par uh, the Persians eventually, which is Parsha right now. We got to worry about them because they're not too friendly to us. And we're also at war with the Lugai, who declared war to us. And I, I don't know, we're not at war with them, but uh, it's coming up, man. People on the north are going to start attacking us as well. There's a lot of enemies around our borders because we are expanding quite a bit. You know, it's uh, that's just how it works. We're going to end the turn really quick. And the first turn and we'll see where this leads us but um hopefully today we uh, can expand even further i'm pretty sure we will be able to expand a lot more and uh just destroy one of the factions we're at war with right now the armenians seem like the biggest danger out there uh we might see where uh this all leads us up but military access for the asd i'm gonna accept uh, as long as we don't, like, I don't think we have a, an, an aggression pack. I'm not sure. I don't remember. But I'm pretty sure we have one. Uh, there we go. They're currently attacking me, boys. 6,000 soldiers. Oh, that's a huge battle right there. 95%. I'll do it. I'm not going to auto result, boys. Let's go. They've got 6,000 soldiers. I don't know uh, what type of soldiers they had, but 95% um, for me. So I'll take it. There we go. Just destroyed the, their entire army, basically. That was stupid of them. Okay, well, just like that, boys. Just destroyed their entire army. So that was easy. Let's go uh, into the menu right here. There we go. Military development. Always do that over civil, uh, uh, civil development. Child is dialed. Atias, gruesome news. A small uh, sparking candle is now extinguished. Oh, one of our child is dead. That is not good. That's not good at all, boys. Which shell is that, though? Hopefully, it's not a very important one. Hopefully, it wasn't my hair or anything. It was. Oh, my God. It was my hair. So, my hair literally died, boys. At 8 years old, too. It was starting to be really good. I had a, a really good hair and everything. Everything was going fantastic. And all of a sudden, what do you know, boys? Of course, I lose him. All right. So, there we go. We got our thing again. Yeah, I don't know. That's that's garbage. I hate the fact that this was a thing. All right, so let's go back really quick. We're gonna we're gonna do our due diligence. We've got um, some armies we can retrain and everything. Let me uh, go ahead and do that really quick. Uh, upgrade all of them. All right, so we've got uh, this general right here. We can give him an up uh, an upgrade. We are gonna give him an upgrade. Do we want terrifying, maga, sadistic, frenzied? I don't know if I want frenzied or not. Drunk yards, dr drill sergeant. Let's just dr do drill sergeant. What about you, buddy? You do have a bonus as well. Let's uh, give you. That's a bonus for my general, though. Let's give him uh, a bonus for this. Gravitas for turn. There we go. All right. So over here, they do have something they can build. Uh, we are going to upgrade that and we're going to build something new. I'm going to build actually this. So some growth for turn, boys. Next thing I want to do, though, is look at every single one of my regions really quick. See if I need to upgrade anything. I do over here. I do need to upgrade something. Let's uh, upgrade this one right here, Bosporus. And Samaria, we do need to upgrade this, the siege and stuff. Looks like they have, Lugai have an army right beside my borders, right beside Tor right here. The, uh, Tor, uh, Tor, I should say. This is not good. And where are they at, though? Is that the only army they got? Maybe they got... Uh, I think they got defeated. They don't, They they lost their original territory, which was here. That's the only army they've got left. We're going to send my army over here. Let's press space really quick. That's my king, by the way. Trying to protect the north. All right, next up then. Where, where do we go from there? We got my... Okay, so my army right here dealing with this shit. Uh, let me get... Okay, so we're not on march anymore. Good. Uh, I, I'm going to... Go over here. There we go. I'm not trying to go through your, ter your territory. Don't worry about it, buddy. I'm just trying to move, okay? Just trying to slowly move right here. I'm not trying to attack you, I swear. Uh, what about... Okay, so uh, her, which is Amala. She's my aunt. Do I want to send her over here? I think I wanted to send her all the way across, though. 
Uh, we're going to send her towards here, though, first. What she's going to do, she's going to go over the waters. And uh, she's going to go over the, uh, the waters and traverse like that. Because that's going to be a little bit simpler for me if she does that. Uh, we got a spy over here, of course. Let's continue to uncover more civilizations here uh, as much as possible. Let's go over here. There we go. Next up, uh, we've got my other spy remaining over here. He's going to uncover as much as possible right here as well. Uh, go ahead and go here. There we go. We've got a faction right here. And we've got a brand new faction right here as well. There we go. A couple more factions uncovered, boys. It's really a shame, though, that I lost one of my uh, sons right here. My uh, my uh, young, uh, my oldest son. And now I got... An, a, at least I'm fortunate enough to have a new heir and so forth. This girl is never going to join me in my confederation. It's starting to piss me off a bit, boys. Are you even going to... She's not even going to join my military alliance or anything. She just d doesn't want to deal with me at all. Like, look at... I, I'm giving her all the money in the world. She doesn't want anything to do with me. Um, what about military alliance, but 100k? Man, you're crazy. You're definitely crazy, lady. I'm gonna keep giving you money. I don't want to go to war with you, but Jesus, she's crazy. All right, next up then. Who do we want to deal with? I want to obviously make as many trade agreements as possible. So we're gonna we're doing we're gonna, we're gonna do a bunch of trade agreements. Defensive alliance? No, no, no. I don't want any def defensive alliance or anything. That's not what I'm here for. Let's just give you some money. All right, give you some money, buddy. There we go. All right, just like that. So uh, some money. Trade agreements because now when you do a trade agreement, you unlock the entire factions, uh, territories and stuff uh, in your in your uh i guess your options so that's what i want to do good there i go we're getting a bunch of stuff boys addings now addings let's there we go i, I want a trade agreement buddy i'll give you uh I've got, i'll give you the 50k boom there we go i'll give you the 50k what about uh this guy right here bastardy I, I want a trade agreement as well i want a trade agreement with everyone let's go there we go just like that another trade agreement Britannia, let's get it everything boys i'm trying to really like get a trade agreement with everyone just so i can uncover all their territories all right so i did it boys all my money is gone now but uh i did as much a trade agreements as i could that's basically unlocking a lot of new uh i guess new factions around that i, I noticed right that's another thing that happens when you do that is you unlock different factions you uh, via the trade agreements and stuff like that so uh, that's what i'm trying to do Un uncover as much knowledge of the territory as possible and and everything just so i know who's where and uh, and when is he there and stuff like that so still sending over my army we're gonna skip a turn really quick and uh see what the next thing is next an aggression pack with iperus for now i'm gonna accept just because i want to i don't want to have too many our uh, enemies here I'm already at war with a couple of them and I, I want to choose who I want to fight uh, early on. So let's do that. They currently want a peace treaty, boys, and they're willing to give me three uh, or four thousand. Basically, I'm not I don't really need the money as much. What I do need is if you want to make peace, we got to be a satrapy, my guy. A satrapy is basically someone that be uh, is a puppet to me. So uh, you want to be you want to be at peace with me? You gotta be a satrap. It. I'll give you some money. I'll give you some money. I got twenty k uh, or two k left. Give you some money. Oh shit! Well, we just accepted, I guess, by accident. We just did a counter offer by accident. I didn't even look. Well, I guess we're at peace now. These guys are attacking me. One k soldiers. Not even worth doing. Not even worth doing, the boys. We're just gonna yeah. We're just gonna skip that one. Yeah, that one is not worth doing at all. It's just 1k soldiers or anything. Let's go. Let's uh, skip that one up. There we go. And I think that we just destroyed our faction by doing so. We might have just uh, destroyed the Lu guy. I'm, pr I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure that's how it, it works. So, research complete. The game is uh, having a tough time really quick. Okay, there we go. Ben is six supply. Fashion destroyed. The Lu guy is, is done, boys. So we basically got rid of two of our wars right here. We destroyed the little guys. We made peace with um, with uh, the uh, the other dudes, though. War declared, okay. So some wars have been declared, but other uh, wars have been 
done with. So I, I guess we're done done with. So yeah, we're not at war with them anymore. Well, since we're not at war with them, they didn't want. I guess they didn't want to deal with us, which is fine in its uh, in of itself. But uh, yeah, I don't know. We're just gonna go here really quick. We're we're, we're gonna go here. We were already at war with them. I kind of want to redeclare war to them really quick, boys, because I don't want to have to. Um, I don't want to. Uh, I didn't want to make peace or anything. I wanted to, uh, them to be my satrapy. Let's attack these guys really quick. There we go. We're just gonna form up really quick, defend my uh, my place up with my ant. Now, first thing we're gonna do is uh, send my there we go my spies over just um, uh, just to make sure that we uncover as much as possible. What about uh, this one? Right here, there we go. Keep on covering, boys. We got a couple more stuff to uncover on, on the north right here. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we got my army right here, my king. He was marching. I think he doesn't need to march anymore because we destroyed the Lu guys. So we're just going to send him over here. We're not going to attack anybody just yet in the north. We're going to wait it out, boys, until uh, there's something better for us, I guess. Or until we're done with... Um, our war over here because I'm about to declare war once again to the Miskita. Or unless m maybe I don't do that. Maybe I just send this guy over. Maybe I just do that, boys. I just send this guy over right here. There we go. I don't make war with them. I just destroy the Armenians really quick on the south. And I do another war on the west. So maybe east and western wars at the same time. That's what I would do, boys. Let's try and do that. That's why I got f I want a, a four armies eventually because two armies for each wars, you know, would be great. Next up, let's continue to do a purge. Uh, now, these guys, they keep popping off. Obviously, the influence, they keep popping off. I don't like that. Nine turns remaining until we are not safe anymore from the loyalty and everything, from secession and stuff. We got to be careful. That's for sure. I don't know if I want to... Well, do I, how many armies do I have? I have three of them, right? One, two, three. Yeah. I've got my two armies right here. I need a fourth one. I need a fourth army on, uh, on the west, western front right here. So what I do want to do is... Who do I want to attack first off? We got to choose our next target. We're pretty friendly with the Arnertes. And we're very friendly with the, the IST. Do we have a non-aggression pack with them? We have a non-aggression pack with them. Uh, these guys are not very friendly to us, not that much. So we could attack these guys, but the thing is, if I, I want my, I want my region right. So if I want to have some Martial together, I should probably attack Aesti and Arnertis. I'm gonna attack Arnertis uh, first. That's what I'm gonna end up doing. We don't have a non-aggression non pack or anything. So I am gonna end up attacking these guys, the Arnertis, which are right here. I think that's the only territory they've got as well. So I'm going to send my king over there really quick. Let's go. Let's send my king over there, boys. Uh, in one or two turns, it'll be uh, another one or two turns. He'll be able to take out the, these guys really quick. So that's what we're going to do. And we're going to we're gonna raise a new army as well. First thing I'm going to do, though, is... Yeah, there we go. I'm going to send a, a new warrior, uh, basically. And he's going to be taking care of that new army that we've got. So royal family, uh, we got to take someone from the royal family. I, I just got to make sure there's someone from my actual family. It could be my wife, Alitum. So we could choose Alitum, boys. We could choose Lakip. We're going to choose my wife, boys. Uh, my wife should be the one to go at war. Uh, should be the one to be uh, there. So let's uh, let's choose her. She's going to be the new general uh, on foot, of course, for the with the horse, like melee, uh, melee unit. There we go. So we're going to do that. And we're going to send... Well, we got a couple of them, I guess. I think the melee, the better one is right here. So we're going to take that one. And there we go. So we got everybody. That army is going to be completely done in the next turn, boys. That's going to be uh, good. Uh, next stop. What else do we uh, What else do we want right here? We want you to attack here? No, we don't. No, we're, we're waiting. Okay, so we're still waiting. Yeah, we, we don't have anything, uh, everything done. Let me look around because we do have a couple of stuff we can build over my regions and stuff that I, I i have on my hands there we go just upgrade every single thing and uh yeah we're good we're good to go boys unless my armies have a bonus i don't think so so i think we're good to go so next thing we do right here 
is we just continue to work on these guys. Well, Eventually they're going to accept. I mean, they're, she's almost like 600 of, uh, of friend, uh, friendship with me, boys. She still doesn't accept, though. Somehow, I don't know what to do in order to make her accept. Like, this point is getting really ridiculous. And she doesn't even want military alliance or anything. At some point, she's going to have to accept the confederation. You, there's not much you can do. You're not at war with anybody. And you're breaking the, the whole thing up. So, come on, my girl. Like, get it together. Come on now. All right, so Odrisian, Parsia. Uh, I was sending my... There we go. I was sending money to the Macedonians and the Romans. That's where I want to help out as much as possible. We're just going to give them money all the time. There we go. Give them uh, 60k. And we're going to give them... A military alliance with them would be great as well. Think a military alliance. Create satrapy. Join war. I mean, they could join a war, but I don't think it would be very useful. So I think I'm going to just go ahead and not do anything. Yeah, not do anything at all. So let, just give them money straight up. Just straight up give them money. The Romans, let's uh, throw some money on them. For some reason, they're not too happy with me. I don't know why exactly. That's kind of a strange one right there. Military alliance, they don't want none. So let's just give them money straight up. There we go. You got some money, by my guy. And uh, next up, who do I want to, I guess, make give money to? I guess the Ath Athenians, right? Because they're a client state of the Macedonians. So that's the next stop uh, for me. There we go. Just give them the rest of my money. And military access while we're at it. There we go for both of us. All right, so that's done. Let's skip the turn, boys. The Armenians want to make peace with us. I'm not about to make peace with them when I, I could literally like get so much out of them. So I'm not about to make peace with them. What I am going to do is I'm going to give them satrapy. You better give me the satrapy, my guy. That's just how it works. Not going to work. No, I'm not making peace with you. I'm not. If you don't want it, I'm not making peace with you. 4,000 soldiers. They've got more than me than my aunt's army. But this general is this um, that's good, I guess. We are going to do the battle, boys. They're attacking us. Let's go ahead and defend ourselves. We're in the battle, boys. Now, obviously, they're uh, they're attacking us, but we're not marching, so we have the chance uh, the chance of mobilizing before the attack. So that's great. Uh, let's go ahead and send all my units right here. Oh, let's mobilize them properly, boys. Let's just do that. There we go. So now they're mobilized and we're going to create a group real quick. My general is going to stay behind and uh, he's going to have his own group. And we're going to have all my archers right here. There we go. Just like that. All my archers. I want them all to be like that. There we go. That's perfect. And we're going to create a group. One of them is going to have the explosives. Explosive shot. There we go. And what about my general right here? I, I need to send him back right here. All right, so we're good. We're good to go, boys. And these guys, do I need to... to do? Uh, let's just do toggle mode on. These guys, Caribbean circle. The units fires while riding in circle. That is fantastic. I would like that, but uh, I, don't, I don't want that just yet. We'll see where this leads us. I'm going to do more of a conventional uh, fighting style right here. Let's go. We already have our explosives uh, launching, boys. You can already see right here. Look at that. They're about to launch. Boom. Die. Just like that, boys. And usually I can use two of them. So I'm just... I'm actually going to uh, use this one as well. Let's do a, fren a bit of a frenzy right here. There we go. Just like that, boys. We do a bit of a frenzy. So uh, two, two of them doing explosives is usually working just fine. What we're going to do right here is, uh, what is that? Rapid advance. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. All of you do a little bit of a frenzy mode. What we're going to do, I'm going to send you over uh, over here. There we go. We're going to send you over here. Do a rapid expand. Uh, rapid. There we go. We're going to move you up a little bit. These guys are going to continue to shoot a little bit. And we're going to actually move them up just a bit just a bit move them up uh, a little bit there we go just like that just move them up uh, as much as possible and you are going to continue to move up as well general we're going to continue to move up draco we're going to do a bit of a frenzy we're going to inspire everybody we're going to inspire one of my units right here 
they're getting absolutely destroyed by my archers right here and if they're not willing to attack me that's just fine by me i'm just gonna keep destroying them uh over here we're gonna well i'm gonna go ahead and ask them to attack there we go attack buddy all of you attack go 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 attack them all of them and uh, all right so next up same thing for you guys there we go attack 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 all of you just all of you attack there we go there we go just like that everybody's attacking boys i'm sending all of them on attack mode all my uh my melee uh, units i guess all of them are gonna attack and while that's going on we're just continue to just continue to bombard so let's take a look really quick at the battle right here what's going on boys take a look holy shit that is fantastic oh my god get the fuck out of my face what the hell are you doing there we go that is fantastic boys i oh, take a look at the explosives from behind as well that's all my generals right here the explosives from behind we're actually destroying them quite a bit oh they're charging look at that literally charging and everything all right let's escape this really quick let's escape them okay so uh, from that perspective these guys are done for let's let's go ahead and attack them really quick deal with that once and for all you are gonna land a hand over here there we go we're pretty much done right now we're literally done with the the whole thing so uh the battle's pretty much done we dealt the damage i mean remember they, they're the ones who attacked us in the first place as well but they can't compete i mean the enemy cannot compete with my grenades it's just how it is boys they can't do shit against my grenades. I'm just super OP right now. There we go. There's the battle. Let's end it over. Just like that, boys. Fantastic battle. We basically killed every single one of them uh, right here. Who got the most amount of um, uh, of wins? Or uh, who got the most amount of kills? It's uh, these two units right here, it looks like. A lot of melee units getting killed from that. Oh, actually, no. This one. Look at that. 1500 uh kills 1700 kills yeah these are the ones that uh were shooting uh explosives well boys i guess they shouldn't have attacked me because they just did like the la the last one uh they just uh, the last faction right they did we made peace with them no uh, over there right no wonder they they made peace with us because they got destroyed after trying to attack us and now the armenians right after trying to make peace with us we refuse them they try and attack us that's what happened. 6,000 soldiers, though. That's quite a lot. Well, I don't think that was not 6,000. This time around it was 4,000. Still a pretty big deal. But, I mean, come on. You can't try and attack me like that. You you know you're going to lose any anyways. War declared to the Pastor Nina Gert, uh, Garti. Forsaken their masters. Tillis. Oh, Tillis just uh, canceled their satrapy from, uh, from Macedonia. Okay. That's quite interesting. All right, so we got it. Uh, we just got to continue to work on our, I guess, our technology and everything, like always. Over here, we got some brand new stuff we can actually build. Uh, first thing we always want to do is always take a look around really quick. Just to make sure that I don't have anything to build at all. Doesn't seem like it. I've got my brand new army right here with my wife. So my king and me, basically, uh, the king and, his, and the queen are both together. And they're both getting prepared to attack. Uh, this faction right here so that is fantastic let's keep it moving right here let's keep it moving and we're both gonna have so they're both getting sent over here there we go both are getting sent over here and that should be good enough in its own next up we've got oh that's right i forgot my um my general i gotta send him over here i gotta send him for for the military training for stuff there we go that's good all right so that is uh that is done Next up, uh, we are going to continue to move up the, I guess, my spies really quick. So we got a brand new, uh, there we go, brand new civilization. We're going to uncover what this is over here, what uh, is going on over there. Uh, over here, we basically know what's going on. Most of the factions, I kind of know who they are. But uh, we're still going to uncover them on the map and stuff. There we go. Okay, so we're about to uncover the Romans mostly, right? We know where uh, Rome is and everything, but we don't know... Like, all their territories, what they actually have. Hopefully, they expand it because the amount of money I gave them, they should be able to expand quite a lot. So, all right. So, let's take a long rear. All right. Let's take a, a quick look really quick for my family. Nothing to see. My uh, 
youngest son, the only one I've got left. I guess he's two years old right here. They still got... Damn, that's a, that's what's rough though. Eight, uh, eight stuff. Like, I can't do anything. Secure loyalty. Can I secure loyalty or anything? Can't really do that, right? Gather support. Seek support of the hesitant strength of your political uh, politician. No, I don't. I don't want that. So I can't really do anything from my uh, family tree. So I guess now we're basically done. We there's not a lot we can actually do, but I do need to send my yeah. I do need to move my armies really quick. So let's move this army up. I was I did say I I was gonna move this army up before I do anything. Let's uh, give the the bonus for my general right here. Let's uh, do drill sergeant. There we go. And uh, she's going to move up right here. There we go. As simple as that. She's going to continue to move up really quick. And uh, she's going to traverse via here. Uh, next up, we've got uh, this guy right here. Now, one of his units is kind of done for. So we're just going to get rid of it. It is a mercenary unit after all. Let's just get rid of it and get another one. Just get another archer uh, melee or... Just get another cavalry unit, I guess. That's all uh, he need, uh, we needed. So let's go over here, boys. Officially, we're not going to be able to uh, to attack them just yet. In the next turn, we're going to be able to do it. Start attacking the Armenians for real this time around in their territories. They've got a spy. One of their spies over my territories, but that's fine. So last thing we're going to do for this video, we're going to try one more time to convince these goddamn people this goddamn girl to join my faction boys ain't gonna happen it, it seems like they really like don't like me or something i don't know why let's just get, keep giving them money a military alliance they don't want none eventually they're gonna accept i mean that 700 how much money do you think she has right now she's gotta be super rich this guy's still at war macedonia is still at war with the aldrigians but for some reason they're not doing anything ab anything about it like, I, I want to kind of get a military alliance going on, buddy, but you're not doing too much right now. You're kind of uh, laying low. You're not doing anything with the money I'm giving you. What about uh, what about you, buddy? Uh, Rome, how are you doing on your side? It seems like they're probably doing uh, quite well. Let's give them the rest of the 72k. And we're going to give them... Uh, do we want... Military alliance? They don't want... Alright, so nobody wants to be military allied with me right now, but... Let's just keep working it out. These guys are at war with Iperus and Carthage. Doesn't seem like they were doing too much against Iperus and Carthage either. They probably took that, but... I mean, we can't really see what they did, so... Guess we're just gonna have to discover it by ourselves, so... Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.